The family mid-size sedan cars are one of the most popular types of vehicles with consumers and with good reason. When it comes to commuting, hauling the kids around town or road tripping, few types of cars balance space, comfort, fuel economy and performance. Whether you're shopping for a daily commuter or you need something comfortable and practical for your family, a mid-size sedan has a lot to offer. With many stylish options to choose from, you're sure to find a model to match your personality, along with plenty of high-tech features and modern conveniences to enhance your time on the road. There are tons of options in the mid-size sedan category. But these are the best mid-size sedan cars you should consider. To make the shopping process less daunting and easier to navigate, I have compiled in my opinion a list of top 10 best mid-size sedan cars from worst to first. Stay with me as I break down the numbers. Please subscribe and turn on the notification so you won't miss any new video. Thank you. Despite being on sale for nearly a decade, it remains one of the best cars in the midsize class. The Fusion generation has always been comfortable, roomy, quiet, and balanced. Ford also did a good job adapting new features to this aging platform. Among these is the Sync 3 infotainment system, which enjoys one of the most user-friendly interfaces on the segment. Even though it's one of the oldest midsize sedans on the market, the Fusion holds up. Ford has signaled that it will soon replace the Fusion with a similarly sized crossover called the Ford Fusion Active. Ford Fusion comes in four trim levels S, SE, SEL, and Titanium. The base Fusion S comes standard with a 2.5 liter four cylinder, 173 horsepower, and 174 pound feet of torque. SE and SEL get a 1.5 liter turbocharged four cylinder 181 horsepower and 185 pound feet titanium comes standard with a 2.0 liter turbocharged four cylinder 245 horsepower and 275 pound feet all paired to six speed automatic transmission with standard front wheel drive all wheel drive is optional from cloth seats to quilted leather a fusion can be spartan or luxurious Overall, the car's multiple interior trims are attractive and in line with what the rest of the class offers. Standard features, a four-speaker stereo system, the voice-activated sync interface, and Ford's MyKey. Available features, the Sync 3 infotainment system, an 8-inch touchscreen, a 6-speaker audio system, 11-speaker premium audio system, and a 12-speaker Sony audio system. Safety and driver assistance features include, standard automated emergency braking standard lane keeping assist available adaptive cruise control ford fusion earned a five-star safety rating 
In conclusion, Fusion major downsides are, fewer standard infotainment features than many rivals. Real-world fuel economy lags behind estimates. Cheapish interior materials. While other automakers doing business in the family sedan market, have been busy improving, and reimagining what a mid-size car can be, Chevrolet has left the Chevy Malibu to languish. Malibu is a good car, but it's not a great one. Its ride is comfortable, and fuel economy estimates are impressive. An affordable starting price also boosts its attractiveness. However, this sedan's drab and dated cabin design, and lack of back support from its seats, hamper its appeal. In fact, it has the lowest overall interior rating in the midsize car class. Plenty of rivals have more modern interiors, and more standard safety features than the Malibu, and many are more fun to drive. To compound the matter, Chevrolet requires adding option packages, to unlock Malibu's available driver assistance features, something many of its rivals offer as standard. Chevrolet Malibu, comes in 5 trim levels. L, LS, RS, LT, and Premier. All trims, except Premier, uses a 1.5-liter turbocharged four-cylinder, 160 horsepower, and 184 pound-feet of torque. Premier, get a 2.0-liter turbocharged four-cylinder, 250 horsepower, and 258 pound-feet. All except Premier, are paired to a continuously variable automatic transmission, CVT, with front-wheel drive. Premier uses 9-speed automatic transmission. While the Malibu's interior, is not the fanciest or the quietest, it is very comfortable and ergonomically friendly. The cabin has competitive passenger space and options, but most alternatives have better outward visibility. Chevy fits every Malibu with its excellent infotainment system, that includes many of today's most desirable options, such as Apple CarPlay, Android Auto, and a mobile Wi-Fi hotspot. While the touchscreen interface, is easy to interpret, the system is losing ground versus the competition. Standard infotainment features, an 8-inch touchscreen, wireless Apple CarPlay, and Android Auto, Bluetooth, a 6-speaker stereo, a USB port, and smartphone integration. Available infotainment features, a Wi-Fi hotspot, wireless device charging, navigation, an 8-inch digital driver display, a 9-speaker Bose stereo, satellite radio, and two more USB ports. Safety and driver assistance features include, available automated emergency braking, with pedestrian detection, available lane departure warning, with lane keeping assist, available adaptive cruise control. Chevrolet Malibu, earned a 5-star safety rating. In conclusion, Malibu major downsides are, interior looks dated compared to rivals, Many advanced driver safety aids don't come standard. No all-wheel drive option.
Volkswagen Passat, trades performance, and personality for an affordable price, and popular equipment. The VW sedan does boast a comfortable ride, and a spacious back seat that will satisfy folks, with a small family. Every model comes with a solid roster of driver assists, and infotainment features. As VW's largest car, the Passat battles with heady players like the Honda Accord, Toyota Camry, and the new Kia K5. While the Passat is far from a best-seller in this class, it offers good performance, and a roomy interior. Giving the Passat a leg up on its competitors, is VW's two-year free maintenance plan, in addition to its competitive four-year, or 50,000-mile warranty. Volkswagen Passat, comes in four trim levels. S, SE, R-Line, and SEL. All trim uses a 2.0-liter turbocharged four-cylinder, 174 horsepower, and 206 pound-feet of torque. Paired to six-speed automatic transmission, with front-wheel drive. This large Volkswagen sedan remains attractive inside, and follow VW's unassuming design language. Though, it's among the most spacious, and comfortable in its segment. The outward visibility in the Passat is excellent. The standard infotainment system includes, a 6.3-inch touchscreen, with a 3-month subscription to Sirius XM satellite radio, Apple CarPlay, Android Auto, and several USB ports. The top model adds navigation, a larger 8.0-inch display, a premium sound system, and a 6-month subscription, to VW's Carnet services. The overall finish is excellent, and the controls are well-placed. Safety and driver assistance features include, standard forward collision warning, and automated emergency braking, standard blind spot monitoring, and rear cross-traffic alert, available adaptive cruise control. The Passat, hasn't been crash tested in the last two years, but 2019 earned a 5-star safety rating. In conclusion, Passat major downsides are, only one engine and transmission choice. No all-wheel drive option. No hybrid or plug-in hybrid. Some low-rent cabin materials. The Subaru Legacy, is a bit of an outlier among mid-size sedans. But it is an excellent choice that deserves strong consideration. Those living in cold weather states have long been familiar with the Legacy. It's easy to understand why, the all-wheel drive. Competing against Toyota Camry, Honda Accord, and Mazda 6. All of which offer more practicality, and sharper styling. But the Legacy offers advantages its competitors simply can't match. First is its value proposition. Starting under $23,000, the Legacy is less expensive than every other midsize sedan, except for the Chevy Malibu, and it beats all others in resale value, except Camry. Subaru Legacy comes in six trim levels. Base, Premium, Sport, Limited, Limited XT, and Touring XT. Base, Premium, Sport, and Limited are powered by a 2.5-liter flat-four engine, 182 horsepower, and 176 pound-feet of torque. Limited XT and Touring XT uses a 2.4-liter turbocharged flat-four, 260 horsepower, and 277 pound-feet. All paired to continuously variable automatic transmission, CVT, and all-wheel drive. Those new to Subaru, 
will enjoy the legacy cabin design. Touting an abundance of high-quality soft-touch materials, and a fresh modern approach to the dash and controls. Base models, are equipped with dual 7-inch touchscreens, to handle most infotainment, and vehicle controls. While all premium trim, and higher models have a larger 11.6-inch touchscreen, with high-definition graphics. Cloth upholstery is standard, but the high-end limited, and touring models have leather. The front seats are well sculpted, and comfortable. Safety and driver assistance features include, standard automated emergency braking, standard lane departure warning, with lane keeping assist, standard adaptive cruise control, with lane centering capability, Subaru Legacy, earned a 5-star safety rating. In conclusion, Legacy major downsides are, low predicted reliability rating, CVT only transmission, terribly intrusive engine stop-start system, The Nissan Altima, isn't the most exciting family sedan. But it's come with a one-of-a-kind variable compression turbocharged engine. Unfortunately, Nissan doesn't allow them to be paired together. Instead, the VC Turbo is reserved for a single model, that's tuned for sportier intentions. The Altima offers an impressive amount of cutting-edge safety features, which are packaged in Nissan's Pro Pilot Assist system. Nissan Altima, comes in five trim levels. S, SV, SR, SL, and Platinum. The standard engine, is a 2.5-liter four-cylinder, 188 horsepower, and 180 pound-feet of torque. Optional for the SV, SR, SL, and standard on the Platinum, is an all-wheel drive powertrain, that reduces engine output to 182 horsepower, and 178 pound-feet all paired to continuously variable automatic transmission cvt with front wheel drive all wheel drive is optional platinum comes with an all wheel drive only sr 2.0 uses a 2.0 liter turbocharged four cylinder 248 horsepower and 280 pound feet inside the ultima's cabin provides a straightforward dashboard with user-friendly switchgear Interior materials vary among trim levels, but everything is a significant improvement, compared to the previous generation. Every Altima except the base model, has a standard 8.0-inch touchscreen, with Apple CarPlay, and Android Auto capability. The infotainment interface is customizable, but otherwise few personalization options. Safety and driver assistance features include, available lane departure warning, and lane keeping assist, Available Rear Automated Emergency Braking Available Adaptive Cruise Control Nissan Altima, earned a 5-star safety rating In conclusion, Altima major downsides are No hybrid or plug-in hybrid option Only transmission is a CVT Uninspiring interior materials Base S trim offers less equipment than rivals Overall, Altima, doesn't feel as modern, or match the cabin quality as several newer competitors.
Even with the slumping of family sedan cars, Kia has crafted a compelling example, with the all-new K5. Its daring design evokes sportiness, luxuriousness, and beautifully sleek-looking four-door family sedan. While the K5 isn't particularly entertaining to drive, its powertrain and ride provide a refined experience. Kia says the new K5, which replaces the Optima, represents one of the biggest leaps forward between generations in recent automotive history. Kia K5 comes in five trim levels. LX, LXS, GT Line, EX, and GT. All are available with either a 1.6-liter turbocharged four-cylinder, 180 horsepower, and 195 pound-feet of torque, or 2.5-liter turbocharged four-cylinder, 290 horsepower, and 311 pound-feet, all paired to eight-speed automatic transmission. Front-wheel drive is standard, and all-wheel drive is optional. Inside, the K5 looks amazing. The layout is both sophisticated and straightforward. The cabin is elegantly appointed, with attractive materials, such as wood trim on the dash and doors, and leather upholstery. The K5 also offers an array of upscale interior features, such as ambient lighting, a head-up display, heated and ventilated front seats, heated rear seats, an air purification system, a panoramic sunroof, a wireless charging pad, and a 12.3-inch digital gauge cluster, with customizable themes, and high-resolution graphics. The K5 comes with a standard 8.0-inch, or an optional 10.25-inch touchscreen. While both systems have a volume knob as well as physical buttons, on the steering wheel, the rest of its controls are touch-sensitive, which can be distracting. Safety and driver assistance features include, standard forward collision warning, and automated emergency braking. Standard lane departure warning, and lane keeping assist. Available blind spot monitor, and rear cross traffic alert. Kia K5 hasn't been crash tested. In conclusion, K5 major downsides are, no hybrid or plug-in hybrid. Wireless Apple CarPlay not available with 10.25 inch infotainment system and snug rear headroom. Mazda 6, isn't just the prettiest family sedan, it's also more enjoyable to drive. While the Mazda isn't as flawless as the Toyota Camry, or as fresh as the Hyundai Sonata. It definitely delivers a more expensive feeling experience, than either of those top flight alternatives. Neither its 2.5 liter 4 cylinder engine, or the turbo version are particularly compelling, and there's currently no eco-friendly hybrid model. But the 6 drives with a mix of athleticism, and refinement that broadens its appeal. It's clear the Mazda 6 is in a different league than the Toyota Camry and Honda Accord. Mazda 6 comes in five trim levels. Sport, Touring, Grand Touring, Grand Touring Reserve, and Signature. The base model Sport and Touring uses a 2.5-liter four-cylinder, 187 horsepower, and 186 pound-feet of torque. Going for the Grand Touring, Grand Touring Reserve, and Signature Models, gets you a 2.5-liter turbocharged 4-cylinder, 250 horsepower, and 310 pound-feet. 
All come with a 6-speed automatic transmission, with front-wheel drive. Inside, the 6 looks like a much pricier car than it is. The quality materials are good for the class, with mature design, and restrained detailing. The cabin is first-rate and best-in-class. Standard infotainment features, 8-inch touchscreen, with Apple CarPlay, Android Auto, 6 speakers, HD radio, Bluetooth, voice recognition, and two front USB ports. Available infotainment features, satellite radio, wireless Apple CarPlay, second row USB port, 11-speaker premium Bose stereo, and navigation. Safety and driver assistance features include, standard forward collision warning, and automated emergency braking, standard blind spot monitoring, and rear cross-traffic alert, available lane departure warning, and lane keeping assist. Mazda 6 earned a 5-star safety rating. In conclusion, Mazda 6 major downsides are, no optional all-wheel drive, no hybrid or plug-in hybrid model, some frustrating infotainment controls, The Hyundai Sonata is a really good way to get attention while driving a family sedan. Its dramatic styling includes exaggerated proportions, a prominent grille, and a bright trim that flows into the headlights to create what designers call a lighting signature. The Sonata is in its eighth generation, and this mid-size family sedan continues to have its sights set on the popular rivals Toyota Camry and Honda Accord. This is the best Sonata yet and it continues relatively unchanged into its second year of production. Even the base model has loads of safety equipment, and higher models boast unexpected technology and amenities. Hyundai Sonata comes in five trim levels. SE, SEL, SEL+, Limited, and N-Line. SE and SEL are powered by a 2.5-liter four-cylinder, 191 horsepower, and 181 pound-feet of torque. SEL Plus and Limited get a 1.6-liter turbocharged four-cylinder, 180 horsepower, and 195 pound-feet of torque. N-Line get a 2.5-liter turbocharged four-cylinder, 290 horsepower, and 311 pound-feet of torque. All paired to 8-speed automatic transmission with front-wheel drive. The Sonata's interior is attractive, and feels like it's worth more than the sedan sticker prices. The back seat is comfortable and spacious. The materials look and feel upscale, and the dashboard layout is simple and ergonomic. An 8.0-inch center touchscreen comes standard with Apple CarPlay, Android Auto, Bluetooth, and a USB port. Available infotainment features, a 10.25-inch touchscreen, HD radio, satellite radio, a second-row USB port, wireless device charging, navigation, a 12-speaker Bose premium stereo, and a 12.3-inch digital instrument display. Safety and driver assistance features include, standard forward collision warning, and automated emergency braking, standard lane departure warning, and lane keeping assist, available blind spot monitoring, and rear cross-traffic alert. Hyundai Sonata 
earned a 5-star safety rating. In conclusion, Sonata's major downsides are, no optional all-wheel drive. Not as comfortable as top rivals. Blind spot monitor not standard on base model. Honda Accord, hardly needs an introduction. It has thrived for decades. Accord, regularly battles the Toyota Camry, for bestseller status. Whether you've been looking for safety, fuel economy, or performance, the Accord has had something to offer. This continues to hold true for the new Accord. It has two energetic engine options, adept handling, and a cushioned ride. Honda Accord, comes in six trim levels. LX, Sport, SE, EXL, Sport 2.0T, and Touring. LX, Sport, SE, EXL, are powered by a 1.5-liter turbocharged inline-4, 192 horsepower, and 192 pound-feet of torque. Paired to a continuously variable automatic transmission, with front-wheel drive. The Sport 2.0T, and Touring, receive a 2.0-liter turbocharged inline-4, 252 horsepower, and 273 pound-feet of torque, both paired to 10-speed automatic transmission, with front-wheel drive. The Accord features one of the best interiors in the class. It's stylish and spacious, and the quality of the materials is great for the segment. In fact, in higher trims, the Accord feels almost like a luxury vehicle. The cabin is one of the nicest, and the seats are spacious, and supportive. All models come standard, with an 8.0-inch touchscreen infotainment system. Apple CarPlay, Android Auto, Bluetooth, 4 speakers, and USB connectivity are all standard. Available infotainment features, navigation, two additional USB ports, an 8 or 10-speaker audio system, HD radio, satellite radio, wireless device charging, a Wi-Fi hotspot, wireless Android Auto, and wireless Apple CarPlay. The top touring trim is thoroughly decked out, with heated and cooled leather front seats, heated rear seats, and a head-up display. Safety and driver assistance features include, standard automated emergency braking, standard lane keeping assist, standard adaptive cruise control. Honda Accord, earned a 5-star safety rating. In conclusion, Accord major downsides are, no all-wheel drive option. Technology starting to lag that of fresh arrivals.
In the shrinking segment of family sedans, there are still some great cars to choose from. But one stands above the rest, for its impeccable driving dynamics, practical interior, value, and reputation for reliability. Camry has long been a benchmark for mid-size sedan cars. It remains one of the most popular and most recommendable sedans you can buy. Is a truly desirable option in a segment that's slumping, but still highly competitive. Long the default choice for those seeking a reliable, comfortable, and inoffensive mid-size car. This latest generation Camry arrived packing stylish looks and strong safety features enabling the Camry to be number one in its segment and to outsell longtime rival, the Honda Accord, and fend off other notable mid-size sedans, like the Hyundai Sonata. Among its strengths are a simple infotainment system, a roomy cabin, a high safety score, great fuel economy, and a punchy V6 engine option. Overall, Camry is one of the best cars in its segment. It is safe, reliable, practical, stylish, and drives well, with Toyota's reputation for reliability. Toyota Camry comes in six trim levels. LE, SE, SE Nightshade, XSE, XLE, and TRD. All trims except TRD are powered by a 2.5-liter inline 4, 203 horsepower, and 184 pound-feet of torque. TRD comes standard with a 3.5-liter V6. 301 horsepower and 267 pound-feet v6 is available in xse and xle trims all paired to eight speed automatic transmission with standard front wheel drive all wheel drive is optional the camry interior cabin is modern with soft touch points and aesthetically pleasing yet durable materials you won't confuse this toyota for a luxury vehicle this is one of the finest cabins in its class it looks and feels upscale, with plenty of soft-touch materials on the dashboard and center armrest. It's also spacious for both front and rear occupants. Cloth upholstery and a driver's seat with eight-way power adjustments are standard. Synthetic and genuine leather upholstery, heated front seats, ventilated front seats, an eight-way power adjustable front passenger seat and a heated steering wheel are all available. The XLE is downright luxurious. However, there's a serious gap in material quality between the entry-level models and the more expensive versions. Toyota's touchscreen infotainment system, called Intune 3.0, is standard across the Camry lineup, with an enhanced version available as an option. Apple CarPlay, Android Auto, Amazon Alexa, Wi-Fi Hotspot, Satellite Radio, a six-speaker stereo, Bluetooth, and two USB ports are all standard. Both the standard 7-inch and optional 9-inch infotainment touchscreens are easy to read and operate. Built-in navigation is offered on higher trims if you want it. Safety and driver assistance features include standard forward collision warning and automated emergency braking, standard lane departure warning and lane keeping assist, standard adaptive cruise control. Toyota Camry earned a 5-star safety rating. In conclusion, Camry major downsides are, elevated levels of wind, and road noise at highway speeds. No plug-in hybrid option. For a powerful and purposeful ride that'll turn heads on the street, look no further than the 2021 Camry. Since it hit the market nearly 40 years ago, Camry has set the sedan trend around the world. Not to mention, it's also been the best-selling car in America since 2002. Let's learn more about this iconic vehicle. Like many modern Toyotas, Camry's lineup is divided along two paths the L grades and the sporty S grades. 
Along either path, customers can choose to equip their Camry with Toyota's available dynamic torque control all-wheel drive, or they can go for more efficiency with a hybrid model. And on the sports side, this also includes a new XSE hybrid grade, which enhances SE Hybrid's performance-oriented design with plenty of convenience features. Additionally, the Camry lineup includes two special edition models, SE Nightshade and TRD. SE Nightshade elevates the vibe with a range of black exterior accents, while the aggressive TRD trim amps up the performance both mechanically and visually. Camry's empowered styling matches its performance with an adventurous look that expresses its fun-to-drive character. This year, LE and XLE grades feature a revised front fascia shape and grille design, as well as new wheel designs on the gas and all-wheel drive grades, while SC and XSE grades also receive a new lower fascia shape, new honeycomb grille, and wheel updates. Camry's styling can vary significantly between grades, so drivers can find the vehicle that fits their personality. For instance, Camry XLE grades are equipped with standard 18-inch alloy wheels and a chrome-finished exhaust tip, while the new XSE Hybrid features 19-inch wheels and a dual-tipped exhaust. Plus, the available LED headlights with black accents help drivers to see and be seen with fully integrated LED daytime running lights and LED tail lights. And as for the special editions, SE Nightshade delivers a seriously sleek look with its black wheels and black trim, including the door handles, mirror caps, badging, and more. Meanwhile, Camry TRD trim also dishes out the head-turning looks with a set of 19-inch matte black wheels, a gloss black aero kit with a raised black rear spoiler, and red brake calipers. Inside Camry, the refined and spacious cockpit interior is tailored for the drive, but also offers a great deal of comfort and convenience. With Softex trimmed sports seating on SE grades and leather trimmed seating on XLE and XSE grades. Plus, the available dual zone automatic climate control lets drivers and passengers dial in the ideal temperature. All in all, this inviting interior offers plenty of space for passengers while the trunk has the cargo capacity for impromptu road trips with family and friends. And Camry TRD's added performance design also makes its way into the interior with a unique MID startup screen, red contrast stitching in seat belts, and TRD stitched front headrests. Camry's breakthrough styling leaves a lasting impression, but it's the technology that brings it all home. The new Floating Dash Audio Multimedia Touchscreen gives drivers easy access to media controls right in line of sight, especially with the available 9-inch touchscreen, which can be further upgraded with a 9-speaker JBL system with the subwoofer for extra bass. But no matter the touchscreen size, all of Camry's audio multimedia systems have plenty of amazing features, including standard compatibility for Apple CarPlay, which connects drivers to Apple Music, Maps, Messages, and other favorite apps from your iPhone. In addition, Android Auto compatibility makes it easy for Android users to stay connected to their mobile devices, while Amazon Alexa connectivity keeps Amazon's digital assistant just a question away, and a complimentary three-month SiriusXM all-access trial offers more than 300 satellite radio stations throughout the country. Finally, Camry also includes an impressive list of available connected services and convenience technologies, like an available 10-inch head-up display, an available 7-inch multi-information display, Qi wireless smartphone charging, and so much more. And of course, to take in the big open sky, there's even an available panoramic glass roof. Built on the proven TNGA platform, Camry offers enhanced handling and overall ride comfort with a wider stance and lower center of gravity that puts drivers in command. In fact, the SE and XSE grades are both designed with a sport-tuned suspension for added control, while the SE and XSE hybrid grades prove that a fun-to-drive car doesn't have to come at the expense of efficiency. And when it comes to speed, the available 3.5-liter V6 engine proves that Camry's performance is more than just comfort and capability. 
Plus, Camry's four-cylinder engine can be paired with an eight-speed automatic transmission with available paddle shifters, as well as an available all-wheel drive system that can automatically direct up to 50% of engine torque to the rear wheels to help maintain traction in challenging conditions. Finally, the track-inspired TRD grade boasts an upgraded suspension system, thicker underbody bracing, and larger front brakes, while a unique exhaust system helps make this Camry's presence known. It goes without saying that Camry's safety systems represent the cutting edge. To that end, all Camry models now come standard with Toyota Safety Sense 2.5 Plus, Toyota's latest advanced suite of active safety technologies that features newly enhanced functionality for features like pre-collision system, lane departure alert with steering assist, and road sign assist. Along with its 10 standard airbags, every Camry also features Star Safety System, a robust safety suite that's designed to help prevent accidents from occurring in the first place. Plus, Camry also offers available safety features like blind spot monitor with rear cross traffic alert, intelligent clearance sonar with rear cross traffic braking, and a bird's eye view camera with perimeter scan for those hard to see objects. All in all, the 2021 Camry is a truly inspiring mid-size car with a knockout combo of style, performance, and remarkable value. And this is taken even further on hybrid grades with the enhanced Toyota Hybrid Battery Warranty, which lasts for 10 years or 150,000 miles, whichever comes first. Hey guys, I'm Bradley Hasemeyer. Today, I'm here to tell you everything you need to know about this, the refreshed 2021 Honda Accord. All right, so let's start on the outside where the 2021 Honda Accord gets some subtle but interesting tweaks to what's already one of the most distinctive and upscale designs on the road. The grille's been widened and it gets new chrome accents. Also the front radar sensor, which is of course part of the standard Honda sensing safety and driver assistive system is more effectively integrated as well. And the new grille also blends better with the headlights, which are improved with longer throw on low beam and further and wider reach on high beam. Also, the lower fascia and the fog light surrounds have been updated. Accord Sport trims also get their own updates, including a dark chrome grille surround and gloss black treatment for the side mirrors, rear spoiler, and the shark fin antenna. There are also three new wheel designs for the lineup. The 2021 Accord is, of course, available with a wide array of accessories from additional protection to custom styling touches. Honda Genuine Accessories has you covered. And what about this car right here? Well, this is a 2021 Accord Hybrid, and we think it's the best of them all. We'll get to that in a little bit, but for now, let's get to the rest of the Accord lineup. Both Accord 1.5 Turbo and 2.0 Turbo get updates to their driving performance also. The engine management software for both engines has been refined for smoother, more linear acceleration feel. On the other end of things, the brake system has been updated for smoother engagement, especially at low speeds. A new for 2021 Sport SE 1.5 turbo trim adds heated and power adjustable leather front seats. It also gets heated mirrors, smart entry, and remote engine start. And this year, the EXL trim adds wireless smartphone charging. All right, so now let's talk safety performance. Now, the Accord is targeted to earn top class collision safety and front crash prevention ratings, due in large part to Honda's ACE body structure and the Honda sensing technology, the latter of which gets some key improvements. Adaptive cruise control has been programmed for smoother braking, especially when following another vehicle, and lane keeping assist has been updated for more effective and natural lane centering. Also new for this year, Accord Touring trims get a low-speed braking system. It uses the parking sensors to alert the driver of a potential collision and even apply the brakes if needed. Honda also added a rear seat reminder system. It uses a chime and a dash display to remind you to check the back seat for precious cargo like pets or kids before you get out of the car. Finally, Accord also features a rear seat belt reminder system. This lets the driver know when everyone is buckled up. And all of this to make sure Accord remains a top safety performer. 
All right, so now let's talk tech. Of course, connectivity in the car is very important. And fun fact, the Accord was one of the very first vehicles to offer both Apple CarPlay and Android Auto integration. And now for 2021, it's standard across all Accords. And for higher trims, there's new wireless Apple CarPlay and Android Auto integration. It'll be available on EXL and above trims on gasoline Accords and EX and above grades with Accord Hybrid. Also, to improve usability, the front USB ports have been moved to the front of the center console, making them much easier to access. And there are two new USB ports for the rear seats as well. All right, now let's talk about this, the 2021 Accord Hybrid. This one here is in touring trim. It comes with all the luxury and technology features Accord has to offer, starting with a hybrid powertrain with 212 total system horsepower. In fact, Accord Hybrid is about a second quicker to 60 miles per hour than the 1.5 turbo. The hybrid delivers that extra power and torque and yet still receives outstanding fuel economy ratings, substantially higher than that from the 1.5 turbo. In fact, the Accord Hybrid offers multiple advantages, really with zero compromises. The Accord Hybrid benefits from a number of updates for the 2021 model year. Those updates begin with notable improvements Honda engineers have made to the way the Accord Hybrid drives. The Hybrid also has more direct and immediate throttle response and a more natural acceleration feeling as power climbs smoothly in concert with engine RPMs. And Honda's two-motor hybrid system spends more time powered solely by its electric motor, leaving the engine off for a smooth and refined driving experience. The hybrids have their own unique styling touches as well. There is, of course, the blue H badge up front. There's also the hybrid badging on the front fender and the rear deck lid. Plus, for 2021, you get 19-inch wheels on this Touring Edition, up from 17-inch last year. And of course, when we're talking about hybrids, we've got to talk about the benefit of great fuel economy and great fuel range. And Honda is proud to have the lowest CO2 emissions of any full-line automaker and to have the best overall fleet fuel economy as well. And Honda's hybrids are a big part of that. And of course, the Accord Hybrid not only fits your budget, saving you money and trips to the pump, but it also does great things for the environment too. Extrapolating from EPA data on carbon emissions, driving an Accord Hybrid for three years versus an Accord 1.5 Turbo, which is naturally more fuel efficient than the average new vehicle, is like turning off the power in the average home for nearly seven months. Put another way, the reduction in carbon emissions is equivalent to those generated from fully charging 430,000 cell phones. So clearly just driving the hybrid can make a real difference. And the great news is it doesn't require any compromise. With Honda's two motor hybrid technology, you get great driving performance, better off the line acceleration, the refined feeling of all electric power and all the passenger and cargo space of a standard Accord. Well, you've heard of the win-win-win concept, right? Well, here it is. And when you put all of it together, it's easy to understand why I said earlier that the Accord Hybrid is the best Accord of them all. The sedan is new again. Discover the all new Hyundai Sonata with reimagined everything. It's innovative state-of-the-art technology wrapped in unmistakable design. The all new Sonata comes in an array of colors Embracing the aggressive curves and sharp lines of a sports coupe with a bolder, wider stance and a lower, longer profile. Sonata's handsome new look comes to life with its unique lighting structure. Up front, what looks like chrome trim tracing Sonata's body reveals hidden LED daytime running lights that brighten dramatically when illuminated. LED headlights illuminate the road ahead, and wide horizontal LED taillights span the back end of Sonata, connecting uniquely on each side for a striking visual design cue at night. Just above, Aerodynamic air fins accentuate Sonata's fastback lines, while available 18-inch alloy wheels ensure Sonata hits the road in standout style. Add some dash with sport front and rear bumpers, a chrome twin-tip exhaust outlet, and a glossy black mesh front grille. Now let's look inside. Before you even enter the cabin, Sonata gives you the convenience of remote start directly from your key fob, setting your preferred temperature before you even get in. The proximity keyless entry means no fumbling for your key. 
Just walk up, get in, press a button, and go. Sink into available plush leather seats and stretch out in the spacious cabin. Sonata is pure comfort. With personalized profiles for two drivers, your experience is tailored to you. With driver seat and side mirror positions, multimedia and heads-up display settings, and more. Stored and accessible at the press of a button. Speaking of customization, the high-definition touchscreen allows you to split the screen between three different viewpoints, so everything you need is front and center. Ambient lighting available in 64 colors lets you add a more personal touch. Now you're ready to open the panoramic sunroof and start your journey. The all-new Sonata makes every drive comfortable, with ventilated front seats to cool you and heated front seats to warm you and your passengers from the core. A leather-wrapped heated steering wheel gives a warm touch on frosty days. And auto climate control keeps the cabin the way you like it, with various levels of airflow intensity to choose from for the comfort and convenience you're looking for. The all-new 2020 Sonata surrounds you with advanced technology to keep you informed and connected. With Hyundai Digital Key, you don't even have to use your key fob to get into your Sonata. Just use your compatible Android smartphone to unlock the doors and start your engine. Plus, you can easily share your Sonata with another driver. Simply text your digital key to friends and family. The 12.3-inch full digital LCD instrument cluster makes it easy to view important driving information and features an innovative blind spot view monitor for added awareness on the road. Surround view monitor gives you a complete look at your surroundings. Choose full 360 degree front, rear, curbside, or aerial views. To also make the drive safer, the heads up display projects key information within your line of sight so you can stay focused on driving. Smartphone connectivity provides seamless, easy access to all of your essential mobile apps like music, messages, and maps right on screen. And your phone stays charged and ready to go with the wireless charging pad. For the ultimate in connectivity, we offer Hyundai's Blue Link system. Using the smartphone app, you can remotely start your car, lock or unlock it, turn on the defrost, and more. Now let's talk ultimate convenience. The all-new Sonata parks itself with the first remote smart parking assist system in its class. Just press the key fob and Sonata easily navigates itself into or out of tight spaces. The smart and redesigned Sonata is powerful and fuel efficient with a standard 2.5 liter SmartStream turbocharged MPI GDI engine or an available 1.6 liter SmartStream turbocharged GDI engine. Both engine options are paired with the smooth shifting 8-speed automatic transmission or use the steering wheel mounted paddle shifters, fun for those who love the manual shift feeling of control. At Hyundai, your safety is our priority. Rely on Hyundai SmartSense, our suite of available driver assistance technologies to help alert you to dangers on the road. The all-new Sonata features forward collision avoidance assist to warn you of a potential collision with a vehicle or pedestrian. If you don't stop in time, emergency braking can be applied. If you drift outside your lane, lane keeping assist is designed to alert you with audible and visual cues. The system can also gently correct your steering to help you remain in your lane. Lane Following Assist can assist your steering to help keep the vehicle continuously centered between the appropriate lane markings. And Smart Cruise Control with Stop and Go adjusts your speed to keep your preset distance from the vehicle ahead, a definite plus in stop and go traffic. When actively engaged with both Smart Cruise Control with Traffic Stop and Go and Lane Following Assist, Highway Drive Assist helps keep you centered in your lane and traveling at a safe distance behind the vehicle ahead. It can help ensure you drive at the specified speed limit and can also automatically slow down the speed of the vehicle before entering a highway curve section for extra safety. Blind Spot Collision Avoidance Assist will alert you if a vehicle is in your blind spot. It will also gently apply braking power on the opposite wheels to help deter an unsafe lane change. High Beam Assist senses traffic and lighting conditions to automatically turn high beams on and off. Parking Collision Avoidance Assist sensors let you know if you are approaching too close to an object as you reverse and can automatically apply the brakes if you get too close. 